www.sampelerwhite.com. Uh, I have a uh, Roan White uh, tea here today. Um, Sampere Harmonie, uh, made by Alain Vosges. Uh, so Sampere, I think uh, you're allowed Marsan and Roussan, uh, but this one is 100% Marsan, uh, blah, 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 30 years on granite and clay soil, limestone elements, vinification small stainless steel vats matured for 10 months and then uh, add a few months after the cork's been put in and here we are uh, ready to try it. So I will. Well this is an intriguing one. Uh, one of those where um, if you like your wines uh, in your face fruity, well steer away from this. It's not that it's not fruity, there's uh, uh, something like a, a peachy character in there, uh, but it's it's second fiddle to more creamy, nutty notes. You know that, uh, is it Greek stuff, halva, uh, where they have uh, almonds and stuff embedded in nougat, as some people say, or nougat, as other people say. Uh, it's got that character. And there's also um, a slightly salty tang to it. It smells, um, uh, it smells enticing, but also smells like one of those things that... Uh, will be um, a bit of a table divider. There'll be some people going, oh, I love that, and other people going, ooh, not sure. Anyway, it smells pretty good to me. And that saltiness really, really does come through. Um, um, and it, 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 it's not a, it's not savoury, but there is, it's, it, I could certainly describe it as a, having a savoury element. Uh, there is that nutty, peachy character. Um, and hangs around in the mouth. It's, it almost feels like it's got a little bit of uh, spritz to it. And it carries on, it carries on. What I, the, my confusion with a wine like this is what on earth would I want to, uh, to, to serve alongside it? Uh, it's because it's got this rich element, but it's also got uh, quite a, um, a, a backbone of uh, not, not really tannin, uh, but uh, I don't know whether they've done a little bit of skin contact. I'm looking at the color. And there is certainly a little bit of a, um, it's not pristine, crystal clear white wine. Uh, it's, uh, it's not, and it's not orange wine, but I wouldn't be surprised if they'd done a few hours skin contact just to get a little bit of tannin out. But there's also acidity to keep it all fresh. And um, so I, that creaminess, that bit of acidity, uh, I would be, uh, I would be maybe, uh, I'm, 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 I'm thinking of, I, I'm, I think of duck confit a lot, but I, I think of something like this would actually be rather nice with that. Or one of those slightly sweaty cheeses, um, a bit of Munster, a bit of um, Gouda, um, but it smells, it smells good and it drinks good. So um, I'll be interested to see how this go down, goes down with uh, other members of the household. I have a feeling that uh, I have no idea how it will go down. Uh, it could be that it gets the big thumbs up, which it does from me. Uh, it could be it sort of gets a, not so sure. But uh, in the meantime, uh, I'm going to certainly enjoy it. See you soon.